Good afternoon, good evening, good morning. This is Pastor Scott with your video word of hope for today. Uh, and it's, it's great to have you here with us. And I'm so honored that some of you follow us. Um, and I have a special word today. It's just three days. And I'll tell you what that means in a second, but hold on. First, I want to make sure you have our text number, uh, 631-769-6712. Text us anonymously with any questions or concerns, or you can email us at lifetalklive7 at gmail.com, and those words will pop up on the screen for you. Let us know what you're going through. But what I want to say today as we enter into 2021, again, uh, talking about this year, three days, and I want you to remember this, there is only three days in all of our lives, and there's only one day we can really or should really be concerned about. You see, we have yesterday, okay? Yesterday is already gone, it's past. Not much we can do about it. If you've made mistakes, you know what's amazing? Confess them to God in Jesus' name and they're forgotten. Let it go. Move ahead. And then we have the other day. That's tomorrow. Tomorrow, very little we can do about. We can worry about it. We can be concerned about it. Will I get COVID? Who's going to be president? What's going to happen? Who all these horrible things. You can do all that, but tomorrow doesn't belong to us. Tomorrow belongs only to God. He is the master of tomorrow. He holds its key with all of its mysteries. So to live in that day is just a fruitless venture. So what does that leave us with? It leaves us with today. From the minute you got up this morning, to the minute you go to bed tonight, it's the only future or destiny that you really have any control over. What are you going to do with this day? My suggestion is live it. Live it unto God of the future. Place that in His hands through faith in Jesus Christ. And let Him get you through this day. And you know what? Scripture says He's only given us mercies for this day okay and they're new every day he'll give us the mercies to get through this day he'll give us the strength and the peace and the hope tomorrow that's in God's hands the only thing you have to be concerned about is that you're in God's family and then your tomorrows they're safe and they're secure this is Pastor Scott have a wonderful day